Hi everybody. Welcome to my channel, Jury Pirate. This is Barbara. I'm coming on to do a video for you today. I'd appreciate it if you'd give me a thumbs up. Um, also share the video if you can. It would be very much appreciated also. And um, comment. And if you do comment, um, please leave a timestamp if you're interested in an item. And don't forget a brief description. It really helps me out when I have to find the item that you're interested in. Um, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. So let me give you a little hint about what's been going on here. Um, I'm getting caught up. But we, of course, I, it just seems like life doesn't uh, um, hand me a bunch of apples. It seems like lately I've been getting a bunch of lemons. Um, my little dog Padme is over at the vet's right now. She's very sick. Um, this is my older girl that's been with me for years. And um, she's got a very, very, very bad urinary tract infection. And um, we'll see what happens. Um, it's very expensive money that I don't have. But um, I owe it to her for all the years of love that she's given to me to try to make her as comfortable as possible in the end of her life here. And um, I'm not, um, I mean, the, the, I spoke with the vets, and the vet said that uh, she uh, will be okay if they can get this urinary tract uh, infection under control. And um, she, there's no reason to turn around and do anything drastic. Um, she should be fine after this. It's just a matter of hitting the right medication and, uh, you know, getting her on the road to recovery. So, anyway, needless to say, I'm not in the best of moods today. I'm worried about her. And um, I figured, let me come here and, and, and try to get myself out of this rut and uh, do a, a, a video or two for you today. Um, which will help me, and I actually picked out a pink and orange bag, which is usually something that's a little bit more cheerful. So, um, let's get started. Again, don't forget to like the video. All right, I ha I'm going to start with a couple of watches here. There's a couple of very, very nice watches. Um, I'm going to see if, it, if anybody knows what this means. There's a dress in the face of this watch. This is a really nice watch. Here's the back of it. Here's the markings in the back. Um, I don't think there's a name or look. Um, I hope everybody's having a good day compared to what's going on here. I know a lot of you are animal lovers so you can understand. I mean I would turn around and put her down if I thought that, that we didn't have a chance at a good outcome, but uh, I was assured that uh, we should have a good outcome on this. I'm just so please do me a favor and just say a little prayer for my little baby Padme. Anyway, um, there is a dress on here. It's a beautiful pink watch. It looks like it's new condition. Um, it's not working. It's heavy as all get out. It's a beautiful watch. So I have that. There you go. There's a good picture of it. Okay. And then I have this one, which um, this does have a name on it. Um, let me see if it's on the back that I can tell you. This is Blue Sister. Okay. Um, and it's by C-H-O- P-A-R-D, quartz, very pretty, um, has a lot of rhinestones going around the bezel, and there's a lot of rhinestones floating around inside the bezel. This looks a little orangey in the camera, but it's not orange, it's a nice, nice pink, um, very pretty watch. So if you're interested in that, there's the back, where it says Blue Sister. Okay. Now I have a bangle. Um, this is orange. And I'm not sure what it's made out of. But it's all like carved. Um, and the, if you can see in here, 
you know, there's different colors of orange that's in this. So it's more than likely probably a plastic, um, but it is very pretty. I mean, it's really nice. It's got roses on it and, um, you know, lots and lots of intricate pattern work on that. Okay, so we have that. Now I have a brooch. And let me see. Let me get my eyes on. Um, this almost looks like it could be a 1928. And it looks, it actually kind of looks like a 1928 style pin. These are all little porcelain roses, and there's pearls, and everything is is in there. There's the back. This is very, very, very pretty. Okay, we have that one. And then we have this, which is really adorable. And this has got a name on it. Let me see if I can see what this says. Hmm. I think this is Avon. Okay, so we have a little pin with two little pink rhinestones here. And then we have a, this looks like a Cupid with an arrow. Little, very nice um, locket. All right. This is very pretty. And it dangles. All right, so we have that. I have a little stretch bracelet here. Um, this is all done in pink, red, and purples. Um, here we go. I got it twisted. Oh. Anyway, let me see here. I don't know why it's all twisted up. Okay, that's pretty good representation of the coloring that's on here. All right, now we have this. Boy, this is one heavy, 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 heavy bracelet. I'm checking it to see if all the rhinestones are in here. This is beautiful. This is also a stretch, really tight. This is silver tone with a very pretty pinks. Good for an October baby. And this should fit just about anybody. All right, let me give you a close up. Hopefully my camera will cooperate. I have, it has its moments, just like me. Sometimes I want to hang it up. Okay, so there you go. You can see how pretty this is. Very heavy. Very, very heavy. All right, this is just a little bracelet, all acrylic. Pink pearls and, and pink acrylic beads. All right. Um, then we have this. Now, this is another one of those necklaces that are by... Wadazzle, okay, designs, and this is going to be 16 inches, it's acrylic, um, it's kind of pretty, it's got a toggle, this is all these really bright big beads, and there's your Wadazzle thing there, alright, so we have that, that's a very, very, very pretty little necklace. Good for this time of the year. I hope everybody's flowers are starting to grow. My daffodils are up in the yard, which makes me happy. All right, let's see here now. Okay, I have this, which is a brooch. And this is, um, some. I think the rose is open roses. And that's pink, and there's the pin on the back. Very lightweight, but very pretty nevertheless. Okay, and then we have, oh, what do we got here? 
Well, this is interesting. Let me get a measurement on this. This is very interesting. All right. This without the extender is going to be 16 inches. And here is these beads. These are acrylic as far as I can tell. All right. Um, and then it has these silver things here that hang down. So there's one, two, three, four, five. And it graduates. Let me see if I can put this on Bertha. So it gives you a better idea of what it looks like. All right. Very pretty. Um, these have a wire going around them. I guess for extra added protection um, to hold them in. But this is very, very nice. I think you'd like this. Okay, so we have that. All right, now I have another one of these necklaces, and this is also by Bedazzled. Um, I think this one's a little bit bigger. I'll measure it for you. I like these chunky. Yeah, this one's 17 inches. And there you go. This is done in the same thing with these Aurora Borealis colored things. Got the disco ball on here. Have a bow. Um... Very, very pretty, different. Very cheerful. Make you smile. Okay, let's get some more stuff out of here. Um, I've got a ring. Um, let me see what this says in here. Oh, boy. Let's say something that says... I think it says 925. Let me look at it from this direction. I'm not sure, but it's very pretty. Okay. Big pink stone. I'll have to test this to make sure that it's silver. I'll let you know about this one. It's got a nice stone. Lots of little stones around the bezel on this. And uh, size-wise... This is a five and three quarters. Alright. Once again... And the camera's annoying me. Try this. There you go. Very pretty. Okay. Do a little more here. All right. I got a charm bracelet. And this here. Well, whatever it is, this is eerie. That's what it is. It's a curved chain, big lobster claw clasp. It's got a dove on it. It's got that. It's got a key, the eerie, and a pearl. Okay. You got a lot of stuff in here. This is definitely an anklet. This is pink. Pink and purple and like a grayish color of cat eye beads. It's large. It's on a stretch. Be easy to go around your ankle. Very pretty little anklet. All right. Now we have this. A little brooch with rose. What the hell? Mm -hmm. 
I don't know, my monitor just turned off. I'm going to continue with the video, so hopefully uh, it'll work. It's still going as far as I can tell. Sorry for that little word. Okay, so there you go. This is a cute little tiny little brooch with the porcelain rose on it. Um, the back, it looks like a 1928, but I'm not sure. Okay, so we have that. Very, 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 very pretty. All right. Get some more out of here. Let's hope it doesn't do that again. All right. Oh, this is nice. Woo! I like this. This here has one of those clasps that you just push in. All right. I like the spatter beads on this. This is pretty long. It's got wooden beads and some metal beads. I think they're metal. They sound it. Okay, length on this is 24, 25, 26 inches. Let me put this on Bertha. Hopefully. There you go. Very pretty. Very, 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 very pretty necklace. And again, I said 26 inches. And it's like I said, it's got that class that you pull it out. Very delicate and dainty. Very, 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 very pretty necklace. I love these beads on this. Okay. Now, this feels like glass. Um, I think it's some kind of a dyed agate. This is gorgeous. It's got all the rondelles with the rhinestones in it. Very, very nice. Alright, we have that. Now we have a little pearl bracelet with a fold-over clasp. And this is done with uh, pink blue. This is just costume, but it's very pretty and delicate and dainty. All right, now we have this ring. I don't see any name on it anywhere. It's a stretchy. Looks like it has some kind of like a leather underneath the insignia. Brand new condition. Okay little stretchy in a coral color. Stretch is good. I'm going to put that with the other one I had. Um, got another brooch. This is definitely 1928. All little aurora borealis crystals going around. The big pearl in the center. All right, there's your back with the 1928. And let me put this pin in its place. If I can get it in there. Okay, give you another shot at that. This is beautiful. All right, put that over there. This one is shell. I'm going to put this with the other stretch bracelet. I'll probably send this one over to the thrift. Although it is very different. Pinks, oranges, and purples. Okay, there's a stretch pearl bracelet. There's another one here, but it's broken um, that would have matched this. So, all right, we'll put that. That's white and pink. I'm going to put that over there. I have a big ring here in orange. Let me see what this says in there, if I can read it. I want my other loop. I can't find my other loop. I don't know what it says, but here it is. Big, big honker. It's adjustable. Okay. There's another adjustable ring. This is smaller, and it has some wear on it. Down here in the back, some of the coppers coming through. 
Very, this is very pretty, believe it or not. Let me put it on my middle finger because it'll fit perfect there. But it's adjustable. Really pretty if you want a pretty little ring. And you can see the back. You can see the copper. Okay. Um, we've got a lot of stuff here. we got another necklace. This is pretty. And I'm going to put this on Bertha. i got to get Bertha cleaned. Okay. As you can see, now this is all pink. It kind of looks orangey or coral color, but it's not. you got all these little roses and then these enamel pieces that hang down. Okay. Very substantial, these pieces down to the bottom. Now, let me see what the measurement is on this. All the way down to the bottom, it's 18 inches. It has a lobster claw with a three inch extender. It's very, very, very pretty. Again, like I said, it looks coral in the pictures from the camera, but it's definitely, let me see here. See now with that light, you can see it's more of a pink color. All right, very, very pretty. All right, what do we have here? Oh, this is pretty. This is old, too. Okay. This one can be worn as a choker, or it can be worn longer. Um, this is really, really pretty, 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 pretty. All right, so you have these beautiful things that go around and it has an extender with um what do you call that not a teardrop but almost like an arrow and it's got a hook closure three inch extender this is beautiful again this is a very pretty pink very nice necklace all right and I got another stretch. This is coral color in the roses. I'll put that over there with the stretch bracelets. And I got another stretch here. And this is all acrylic also. All right. I got my front door open today. It's actually warm enough. A um, little shell necklace with coral colored shell. I'll measure for that for you in a little bit. This one's interesting. Let me see here. Get it together. Um, all right, hang on. I'm going to measure this first. This is definitely a choker. And this would, it's 14 inches, so you got to have a very small neck for this. Okay, no extender. This one... It's got a lot, um, excuse me, um, it has a uh, spring ring clasp on it. And this is in, it's got pink, it has tans, um, combination of seed beads, glass. This is very pretty. And we're getting down to the end here. And this is... Um, 18, maybe a little bit over 18, but there's no extender. Very pretty. Okay. Now, let's see what this is. This is just a bracelet, and it has, there's a little bit of wear on this. In fact, I'm going to send it to the thrift, put it over there. All right. Now, this is pretty. Um, wow, this is very pretty. All right. This has one of them funky little box clasps on it. And it has this beautiful, beautiful pendant down at the bottom. Very delicate and dainty. I'm going to test that because those stones look incredible. They really do, although the piece itself that they're in doesn't look that incredible. 
I mean, as far as the the um, the 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 sit, you know, the oh, you know, like maybe the plating on it. But I'm gonna give it a test anyway because the stones are gorgeous. Let me show you this close up if the camera will allow me. It's really beautiful. Okay, and the pearls on this are this is gonna be a 16, 16 and a half, so that's gonna be 17, 17 inch necklace, not counting the pendant. Alright, then we have a nice memory wire one here. I like this. This is made out of the paper beads, but I I love this one. I mean it's just um the coloring and, and everything is, is absolutely gorgeous. And it wraps around, let's see here, I'm putting it on now. It'll fit anybody too. It wraps around, um, it's in coral color. It looks more orange in the camera, but it's not. And it wraps around like five times. So we have that, that's very pretty. Okay. We've got just a couple more things. All right. Let's see here. We have a pair of enameled earrings. There's no date delicateness to this. You know, as far as date, um, well, I got this. I got to put that with that. All right. So these are um, a very pale pink enameled semi-hoop earrings very pretty no name okay and I have um, I have this pin and it's a a heart with an arrow through it it's one of the pins with um, it's those it's two two teardrop oh come on Two teardrop beads that make up the heart. There you go. Very pretty. Two teardrop rhinestones. All right. I don't know if I showed you that. I got an ankle. I'll show it to you in a minute. And I have these. Okay. Hang on. These are pretty. These are dangles. All right. These are in orange, large teardrop on the bottom, small teardrop on the top, and gold tone. There you go. Very, very nice earrings. Now, what is this? Oh, I don't see a name on this. This is an illusion, but it's in good shape. It's got a great pendant on it. And... I don't know if you can see this pendant, but it's got a lot going on in this pendant. All right, so that's that's very pretty, and it's in good shape. It's not all kinked up or anything. All right, so we have that. Then we have this little enameled cloisonne heart pendant. This is very pretty. It's tiny. It's probably a little bit smaller than a quarter. Heavy, though. Very heavy. Very pretty. And I think the last thing that we have this here, which I think is an anklet. And this has got a flower on it. Let me see. There's a name on this. Let me see if I can see what it is. Hopefully... Save on. And it's an anklet. I'm going to put it into the extender. And it's got an extender. It's really adorable. Alright. So we have these little beads on here. And then we have this pink flower. It's done in silver tone. Okay, there's the extender with the bead. And like I said, it's an Avon piece. Alright. There you go. Very pretty. Don't usually get too many anklets, but I got a couple today. I got another stretchy right here. I'm going to put that on that pile over there.
And the last piece that I have is this little heart. And it's got the porcelain flower in it. So that's it for this bag of pinks. Not too bad. I'm not I'm I'm happy with it. There was a few interesting things in here. Um you see anything you like, remember, turn it and put your uh comment with the timestamp and uh a, a short description and don't forget to like the video and please pray for my little girl Padme. I'm very worried about her right now. Um I just want to get her back home and make her comfortable. So I hope everybody has a wonderful day. And um, I will get this video loaded up right away and put it on so you have something to look at. And I'm going to be doing another video after this. I'm just trying to keep myself busy. So everybody take care of yourself. Stay safe, happy, and healthy. And I will be seeing you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.